dear students in last class we started the study of critical voltages and in that we have written an expression for delta that is the air density correction factor and using that we have written v dash as equal to r g naught delta ln of d by r now let us call this equation as phi u and this equation as 6 now we will take up critical disruptive voltage it is a voltage at which complete disruption of dielectric occurs disruption of dielectric occurs it means that the dielectric between the two conductors that is air loses its insulation property and you know that when the insulation loses its dielectric strength it becomes capable of carrying electric current it corresponds to the gradient at the surface of conductor equal to the breakdown strength of air this voltage can be calculated using equation 6 if the conductor is solid and smooth Normally, stranded conductors are used.
in the lines and their surfaces are not smooth see usually in transmission line a single solid conductor will not be used single solid conductor means a cylindrical conductor instead a conductor will be made up of many small conductors like this and if you see it in cross section the conductor appears like this stranded conductors have better flexibility than the solid conductors so when conductors are having a shape as shown here in cross section definitely their surface area will not be smooth as of this conductor the breakdown voltage for the stranded conductors which are not having smooth surface is somewhat lesser than the breakdown voltage of smooth surfaced conductor and right here single conductor can write stranded conductor this is smooth cross section this is rough cross section due to irregularity of surface comma dust and dirt on the surface of conductor there is a further reduction in
ट्रैक डाउन वोल्टेज सो अलाउिंग दि सर्फेस irregularity factor m of the wire and air density correction factor the critical disruptive voltage and this critical disruptive voltage is between phase and neutral will be vc c stands for critical disruptive v for voltage r into g not into m into delta ln of d by r let us call this as equation 7 the value of this m lies between 0.8 and 1.0 the value of m lies between 0.8 and 1 it should be noted that the above voltage is valid for a fair weather condition that means clean atmosphere in case of a foul and bad weather condition the value of m decreases further and hence the value of vc while calculating the critical disruptive voltage for corona
the units of G naught and R must be taken carefully. Next we will take up visual critical disruptive voltage. The critical disruptive voltage that we just now studied is not visible because the charged ions in the air will not be having there the sufficient energy to cause further ionization by collision. But when the voltage further increases between the conductors, then at some point the corona becomes visible. The voltage at which the corona becomes visible is called as visual critical disruptive voltage and it is denoted by VV. It is denoted by VV. at critical disruptive voltage corona occurs but it is not visible because The charged ions in air must receive some finite energy to cause further ionization by collision. When the voltage further increases at some point that means at certain voltage the corona becomes visible
this voltage is called critical disruptive voltage the gradient corresponding to this uh, critical disruptive voltage is given by gv the gradient or critical visual corona is denoted by gv the distance between g not and gv is called the energy distance the distance between g not and gv is called the energy distance and this energy distance is not measured in terms of centimeters or meters it is measured in terms of volts per meter it is measured in terms of volts per meter to calculate the value of gv mr peak gave an empirical formula empirical formula means a formula written by observations and such formula will not be having any derivations peak gave the following empirical formula for gv which is as follows gv is equal to g not into delta into the bracket 1 plus 0.3 under root gv equal to g not into delta under root gv is equal to g not into delta into 1 plus 0.3 by r delta kilo volt per centimeter let us call this as equation 8 for two wires in parallel
the visual critical disruptive voltage is given by R into in the expression for VC that is critical disruptive voltage we will replace G naught into M by GV into MV LN of D by R that is equal to the value of G naught is 21.1 kV per centimeter RMS. So 21.1 into MV as it is, R as it is into delta inside the bracket 1 plus 0.3 divided by under root r delta ln of d by r kv and this is rms value now because we are using here 21.1 RMS value. If we have to calculate VV, then we have to take the value of D and R in centimeters. So we will write here where D and R in centimeters the value of the value of surface that is roughness factor MV is different from M now I will give you the definition of local corona we have seen that in case of stranded conductor the surface of conductor is rough when the surface is rough as shown here corona will not occur initially everywhere throughout the length of this conductor it may occur at certain points where you find the spike like structures where you find this spike like structures on the surface of conductor such a corona is called as local corona such a corona is called as local corona so what is this and this here and like that other points these are points of occurrence of corona on 
rough surface conductor if conductor is smooth in that case the corona will occur throughout the length of conductor at a time if the distance between the two conductors is uniform and the atmospheric conditions are similar such corona is called as general corona what such corona is called as general corona as conductor surface is irregular as conductor surface is irregular and visual corona occurs at some points of the conductor and is called local corona the surface factor is point 82 and irregularity factor is 0.90 the surface factor mv is 0.72 for local corona and point 824 general corona now we will take one example based on the critical disruptive voltages i request you to write down this question a three phase transmission line is having three conductors equilaterally spaced 6 meter apart the diameter of each conductor is 2 cm the air temperature is 27 degrees celsius and pressure is 72 cm of mercury if the surface factor is 0.82 and irregularity factor is 0.90 find the critical disruptive and visual critical disruptive voltages first we will calculate air density factor that is delta
3.92 into b divided by 273 plus t that is equal to 3.92 into pressure is given as 72 centimeter of mercury so i'll write here 72 divided by 273 plus 27 temperature is 27 degrees celsius so this will be equal to 0 0.9408 it is value of air density factor Phase to neutral critical disruptive voltage that is VC you have to find here which is given by R where R is radius of conductor in centimeters G naught the maximum intensity or gradient M into delta Ln of D by R Since diameter of each conductor is 2 cm, radius will be equal to 2 by 2 that is 1 cm. Therefore, Vc is equal to 1 into 21.1, this is the value of G0 into point nine zero this is given as irregularity factor into delta delta value is point nine four zero eight we have calculated into ln of d by r the spacing between the conductors is 6 meter we have to convert that into centimeters so it will be 600 centimeters divided by 1 on simplification we get 114.29 kV and line to line critical disruptive voltage is equal to root 3 into Vc because it is phase voltage root 3 into 114.29 that is equal to 197.95 kV using equation 9 After 8, 
will number this equation as 9 here. That is VV equation is numbered as equation 9. Now we will find the critical visual disruptive voltage. That is VV is equal to 21.1 into MV into R into delta inside the bracket 1 plus 0.3 under root r delta ln of d by r substituting the values mu value is given as 0.82 radius is 1 centimeter delta we have calculated as 0.9408 1 plus 0.3 under root 1 into 0 0.9408 into ln of 600 by 1 that is equal to 136.3 3 3 kV. On simplification, you should get this value. Hence, line to line critical visual disruptive voltage. is equal to 136.33 into root 3 that is equal to 236.14 kV dear students I will stop the class here in next class I will continue with corona loss Thank you.